All right, people, the pea fish have returned. There was a fake show tonight, and I was really into it. They have returned to my life, anyhow. And uh, so this fake show, I stumbled upon a link tonight. Ryan Storm posted it on Twitter, and uh, he did something really cool. You know, I wasn't real sure. What, I wasn't even sure what I was clicking on or what is this. You know, I just knew it was going to be some fish that I wasn't picking. Well, then he put together a show. He tried to take like a so songs that and just, uh, I'm going to do a horrible job describing it. He did a much better job of execution. Well, yeah, we'll just roll through here and, and you'll kind of get the hint. All right. So we opened the night. I mean, boy, and it was fire from beginning to end. And, uh, fire at the end. That was kind of appropriate. I don't know if Ryan did that on purpose. I don't know if this will ever get back to Ryan. I don't know if anybody, uh, whatever, dude, you did an awesome job. So anyways, we open up with Down With Disease, the one from July 22nd, 1997, and then he works in a mics, just as that down, I mean, it just seemed flawless. It seemed like something that was really happening. So he takes that Down With Disease from July 22nd, 97, and then just as it's about to go into mics, it does, but then he takes the mics from Big Cypress. We go from that Big Cypress mics into Simple from 81298, and all this just smoothly going together. Then we get to my first highlight of the night. Well, my personal highlight. There was a lot of stuff here, you know, there was, it was like, I'm so glad I stumbled upon this. So anyhow, we get the July 23rd, 1999, Punch You in the Eye, my very first fish show. So then as that Punch You in the Eye starting to drift and get a little spacey and jammed out, he goes into the split open and melt from Coventry. Who knew that a, something from Coventry would fit into like a fish, like a, I don't know, I don't know what this is, but anyhow, like a, a greatest fish moments put together into a fake show. You wouldn't think, suspect a whole lot of Coventry. But that melt jam spliced right into this punch you in the eye was absolutely perfect. Goes back to the punch you in the eye, finishes up, and then we're going to Wolfman's brother from SPAC. Trey with the telephone ringing in Wolfman's. He was caught somewhere in between like his 90s cordless phone and maybe his new Blackberry. It was a very bizarre ringing of the phone there. So then we get into Week of Pog Groove after the Wolfman's. We got a Mike's from 1230. We get a Week of Pog from 1231. Again, don't know if that was intentional, but a nice little, you know, sprinkle of sugar on top. And then we end the set with a five, just a flashing Golgi from 21797. And Golgi, a song like, again, I, I saw, if I'm listening on my own, I'm probably not going to pick Golgi. So I'm glad someone else put a show together for me. So that was the end of the first set. We get a Disease from 97, a Mike's from Big Cypress, get the Coventry Meld in there, and really good Punch You in the Eye, really good Golgi. Not to mention a Wolfman's and a Week of Pog. So then Ghost, the Amsterdam Ghost 7197, opens up the second set. He takes that into Chalk Dust Torture. And then it felt like basically the majority of the second set was this made up chalk dust torture the chalk dust jam drifts into the Dayton down with disease one of the few points like there's people in the chat guessing the jams all night I'm never great at that but that was one I definitely recognized and then the Dayton disease goes into the Alpine Ruby Waves another one I definitely recognized two shows that I was at and then I was on a complete roll he goes into wingsuit and immediately I was like it's got to be the Baker's Dozen wingsuit and then there was also some discussion in the chat is like wingsuit an underrated song and perhaps it is, but not on this channel. You know, I don't know if you're if you're a fan of this channel and you watch my recaps, you know, big wingsuit guy right here. So then finally we get around to Chalk Dust Torture, 11118, wrapping it up this big run. Run of jams. Like I said, we started out with the SPAC Chalk, Chalk Dust from 04, got the Dayton Disease, the Ruby Waves from Alpine, the wingsuit, then back into Chalk Dust. And then when Chalk Dust was finished, he ended it with a, a, a second set, closer, fire, encore, that's about what you, I mean, and it was pretty realistic, you know. I mean, although that crazy, crazy start to the first set, not something we're going to get every night. But the openers, the closers, the encore, and then, then in typical F Zappa 20 fashion, I bounced on the encore. I think if you play, there's a plane in the band, Grateful Dead cover, boom, out of here. We got a show. It felt like a real show. I'm sure everyone's forgotten about me in the last year, but if you watch this, boom. Give it a thumbs up. And Ryan, if this happens to get back to him, man, that was an amazing job. We all told him how amazing it was during the uh, show and in the chat. But boom, give that guy two thumbs up. I don't know. I need to do something, man. I need to stay a little fresh. Eventually, we're going to get some fish shows, they say.